Magnus, you, you said at one point that if you were to play a world championship match, you would hope it would be against Ferusha. Is this the kind of match or these the kind of games that you would really hope for then? Yeah, um, not really, because I was under pressure the whole time. Um, I, feel, I, feel, I feel like I've had the same thing against him like a couple of times in Norwich's already. Um, either Blitz games or in that case Armageddon games that um, um, that just get, get way out of hand. Um, actually, I just blundered early on. Um, I thought I didn't see that he had um, Knight take c4 when he uh, when he did. I thought he had to take with the pawn, then I moved the bishop. And whatever the evaluation may be, I thought it was just a very complicated position where it's at least playable. Uh, and uh, yeah, after what's happened, I thought it was quite a bit worse. Uh, and after I exchanged queens, I was hoping I was surviving, but then he wins the third pawn. I couldn't see how to to get on after that. Uh, and uh, at some point, I was just dead lost. Uh, but, um, you know, <laughs> you fight till the end. Games with a lot of complication, is it motivating? Yeah, for sure. Um, I mean, it's not maybe the kind where I have the biggest edge sometimes but you know right now I enjoy it a lot strive towards complicated games most of the time and I'm successful at least um, enough to be leading the tournament you have your destiny in your own hands you play Pragnananda tomorrow what do you think about that match uh, I don't know what happened in his last game like he he won he lost, he lost the tie break uh, he lost the tie break so that means he has to uh, so that means if I make it make the tie break tomorrow, then I'm beating both Alareza and uh, Prague. So that's good to know. Good luck. Thank you.